why do they lie so much? They think we're dumb or what's going on? Yeah. They want to tell so many lies that you don't have time to counter them all. It would take five hours to counter all that. I mean, I, I gave up in my note taking. Yeah, yeah, everything was a lie. I, I, I mean, the biggest one was like, yeah, this woman got killed by a legal alien. We're trying to stop that. I want to shut down the border. He said, when I win, immediately surge the border. And then they had the big NGOs, the State Department that funds the UN NGOs, have all the illegals come up here. They have UN camps in South America and Central America and in Mexico. And he's running it all. He says, come here. They show up by the thousands in Biden shirts. So he's like, I'm so sad. The illegal aliens are killing you. And many of them are convicted felons, a large portion. And then he's acting dumb and saying, oh, no, no, I'm really sad. Illegal aliens are raping and murdering citizens. So just that little window there, he's playing the good cop to his own globalist policies. Everything that the State Department, the Victoria Newlands won. And you, you're absolutely right. First, he comes out and says, Trump is Hitler. And then he moves on to Ukraine. So it's not about the dying city. It's not about the fentanyl and the needles, and the illegal aliens everywhere and the homeless everywhere. It's all about Ukraine because that's their big model to distract us and also launder money. So this is a very, very dangerous moment for America. The concerns raised by Alex Jones about the prevalence of falsehoods extend beyond mere observation, indicating frustration with the lack of transparency in political discourse. Questioning why misinformation is so rampant reflects a deep skepticism towards the motives behind shared information. Jones's worries, though perceived as simplistic, reveal an erosion of trust and anxiety about the impact of falsehoods on decision-making. There seems to be a deliberate tactic to flood the public with lies, potentially to control narratives and suppress opposing viewpoints. The idea that countering every falsehood is overwhelming leads to frustration and a sense of helplessness. Jones and Tucker Carlson highlight discrepancies in Joe Biden's immigration stance, emphasizing globalist policies and fostering feelings of betrayal among specific demographics. They argue that issues like Ukraine distract from immediate social concerns, criticizing the prioritization of global narratives over local issues. This narrative could affect individuals' sense of purpose and connection with their communities.